under Rule 72.2 of the Rules of Procedure and Conduct of Business of the Lok Sabha, I hereby rise to oppose the introduction of the bill. I oppose it on three counts. First of all, a bill which was considered by the Joint Parliamentary Committee came back to the House, was withdrawn by the government, reintroduced, cannot be introduced as a finance bill. Number two, it's a bill which requires serious reconsideration by a joint parliamentary committee for the simple reason that it is in complete contradiction to the fundamental right of privacy upheld by the Supreme Court in the Putu Swami judgment. Yeah. Number three, this bill cleaves the entire digital universe into two parts. The, uh, the, the, the bill will apply with full force to all non-governmental organizations and the entire government universe is going to be exempt from it. So therefore, the fundamental right to privacy laid down by the Supreme Court in Puttu Swami stands assaulted by the provisions of this bill and therefore this I... Okay, okay, please. Sir, under Rule 272, I Ji. stand here to oppose the bill on two small points. I will not repeat any. First is excessive centralization of all the data. Everything will be controlled. It's a complete insult and hurting the spirit of the federal... Uh, we have to deal with the federal structure of government of India, okay, point number one. Okay. Second, even right to information is diluted. It Right, Manish Ji said, government of India will be completely protected, others will be completely exposed. Third, there is a penalty cause which from to 500 crores is brought down to 250. What is the meaning? Even a small NGO tomorrow challenges is 250 and a big industrial home, which is ridiculous. And there is no compensation. There is penalty, but what about a victim? There is no clarity of compensation and right to privacy. Tomorrow it's completely evaded, sir. So anybody can have our data. There is no privacy. So okay. I request the minister to kindly reconsider. Right. Sri N K Prem Chandranji, sir, sir, I, I, please, I, I, please, sir, please. I strongly oppose the digital personal data protection bill 2023. Sir, 23. The point is, sir, sir, what? Please, please, sir, no, no. no. Sir, to carry on. sir, sir, idea, sir, idea. sir may, make, make, may make a submission regarding yesterday also this matter was raised in the House regarding Rule 72.2. Not only the legislative competence, any matter can be opposed. 72 clause 1 is the general clause and proviso is saying that to have a full-fledged debate in the House, legislative competence is to be there. But as far as opposing any ground, I can oppose the bill. So number one ground is the basic human fundamental rights is being taken away. That is being accepted as the fundamental right in nine bench constitution bench of the Supreme Court in respect of this Putuswami case. So it is totally violating the basic fundamental human rights of the citizens of the country. And number two, sir, day before yesterday, the IT standing committee, that is standing committee on communications and information technology has submitted a parliament committee report standing committee report on the floor of this house yeah. that is so many recommendations are, are there without looking into the recommendation of the standing committee coming with a new bill it is not fair and proper on the part of the minister in introducing the bill so I strongly urge that those recommendations may be taken up so as to respect the Shri parliamentary Adira committee Ranjanji. with this object. Sir as the former chairman of the standing yeah, yeah. committee let me say that this is a matter that we have repeatedly requested the minister to take the committee into confidence. It is a matter of disappointment that to the best of my knowledge, the committee has not been asked to study this bill, which as has been pointed out, has been repeatedly modified by the government and is brought in its third iteration to this house in this condition. Given the vast number of objections you've heard, Mr. Chairman, I would urge that the bill be sent to the standing committee for proper examination as a new bill, because for the three different versions do not match and they have been done without consultation with the committee whose mandate it is. Legislative competence ke baare mein kisi bhi manivar sadhasi ne prashna nahi uthaya hai. Jo prashna uthaya ki kya ye finance bill hai, kya ye money bill hai ya general bill hai. Mai ekdam spasht tarikhe se manivar Manish Tiwari ji ne kaha ta bhi, mai spasht tarikhe se sadhan ke saamne aapke samaksh rakhna chahunga ki ye ek general bill hai, ye money bill nahi hai. Iske upar pura detail mein discussion hoga. इसके ऊपर जो भी पॉइंट अभी मानेवर सदस्यों ने रखा है, चाहे पुट्टू स्वामी जजमेंट से संबंधित हो, चाहे कॉम्पेंसेशन से संबंधित हो, चाहे गवर्नमेंट जो जो आरोप लगाया गया है कि आपने अपनी बात रख दी है, आपने अपनी बात रख दी है, नो नो नो, प्लीज सिट डाउन, आपने अपना विषय रख दिया है, नाउ लेट द हाउस 
मान्यवर चेयरवर मान्यवर चेयरपर्सन सर हर एक विषय पे डिटेल में डिबेट करने के लिए सरकार तैयार है मैं आपसे अनुरोध अनुरोध करूंगा इसको इंट्रोड्यूस करने की परमिशन